okay for this particular session we will look into this authentication bypass uh, I've already launched my web code all right and I have logged in so you can see your I'm logged in here and I've also launched my Z and it's configured so that I can actually see what is going on I will need zap later on now I'll leave this one on I'll leave my zap on to do the interception later on and in the first page basically you will see some read up I will leave that to you now if we go into the second page of this authentication bypass on the top portion uh, there is a case study that you can actually run through uh, and at the bottom you can actually find a scenario All right, so you are supposed to uh, go through uh, this uh, verify the account right? something like a forget password so that later on you can actually change your password All right so uh, I need to fill in these two things here which is what is the name of your favorite teacher and what is the name of street you grew up on now assuming I do not know the answer but, but I still want to bypass this particular form so what do I do alright so let's say okay uh, I just key in some value I'm not going to click the submit I'll just leave it here now I want to intercept the response by the post later on so I'm just going to run my interception okay and now I'm going to click the submit now of course uh, the interception actually works so I can see this is what I key in just now right my name and this is the dummy street now what can I do here of course uh, in penetration testing there will be a lot of uh, try and error guesswork and so forth but I will skip all those all right, uh, there is a few techniques usually use uh, I could uh, remove the entire parameter I could remove one of the parameters uh, I can even swap the space right, uh, the position but I will skip all this and go straight to the answer uh, you will see that there is two parameter here uh, one is uh, of course your set question 0 and set question 1 over here right, so you have set question 0 set question 1 and both of these will be verified now let me just make a change on the parameter here and here and I will let this go through now what happens here is that you will see this congratulation uh, message right, which means now I can actually change my password so you can see please provide new password so I can key in the new password here confirm the new password so although I do not actually know the answer right, to the form right, I actually managed to trick the system into allowing me to bypass this uh, forget password form uh, feature right. so this will more or less conclude the authentication bypass and uh, if I go into the next authentication floor is actually the JSON web token but uh, you will notice that it is actually still under development on the top there are some reading over here All right. and if I go to the second tab there's actually nothing much here it's just to type in my name and using this JSON is actually reversing my name like this so I believe that this is still under development so uh, we will skip this right. 
right so don't choose (uh) this (uh) jason right (uh) token okay for your assignment right so what we have covered here is the authentication bypass alright and we have just gone through the two F_A password reset